Shamlo Delvine, 1873. Weighing in at 2.5 pounds with an overall length of 9.6 inches, this is the revolver that became the first universal handgun of France. To load up, rebound your hammer, open the gate, and load in your six rounds of 11mm French ordnance. No abity system here, so we have to manually rotate our cylinder each time. Close it up, and we're ready. Dense, with a high bore axis, it feels like all the weight is at the top of my hand. At least our grip angle feels pretty comfy. I'm able to reach the trigger and hammer with relative ease. And speaking of, that hammer is surprisingly smooth, somewhat light to thumb back. No auto rebound though. And our trigger has a long clean pull. The bead-like front sight is tall, but the rear V-notch is shallow. Recoil is very mild, and with our captive ejector, we can slowly empty out. Overall, this was outdated by 1914, especially with that cartridge. But don't forget, the same year it was adopted, the US was adopting a single action. If you'd like to know more, subscribe to see an arsenal.